The inspiration for this composition comes from two sources. One, Amazing Women, and two, Temples. While in Portugal, I stayed with a friend in the village, and she was from a town called Nazare. In the Nazare, you have these women, these Varinish women, the women of the sea, the women who carry the community, the family, and the world on their heads. After sketching, I design. Now I'm going to show you my process. Here, I use verticals to evoke the strength and pillar likeness of these women. Above the pillars goes the horizontals, the weight of the community and the family upon their heads. To bring order, beauty, repetition, variety, scale, I use this little tiny tool. It allows me to order my lines and in this whole composition I only use eight directions. When there's at least 360 in a circle. What I really needed to focus on was the conversation among the women. And using the arabesques and the curves, I achieved a beautiful, wonderful moment. Now we get into the values. Here, I begin my noting. I flesh out the noting with just black and white, and then I add a 50% gray tone down the children in the bottom, the face on the left, and then also to add clouds in the top so that the pillar feels like it goes all the way across. When I relay over my tracing paper to see the curves and the straight lines and the note and design underneath, you can really begin to see the life of this image. And we haven't even began to paint. So we go deeper into the values. Here, in the dark areas, in the 50% areas, and in the white areas, I designate a certain range of values to communicate the form and the energy of the piece. Using my Coptic markers, I lay out a scheme, follow my plan, execute it, and I'm left with this.